Hello guys, I'm Ruben Fox Gamer. Today, big showing you a tutorial in Autodesk Maya on how to make a car drive in a in a path and do some skids. So, in my case, I made a car. Uh, if you want, go download the car by by all means. In my case, I just made a car like so. So, good practice is let's go to polymodeling and just hit delete history and freeze transformation that will prevent um, weird deform deformities when we do animation and we are just going to rename this for good practice now the next step is Control g Control g twice so it's going to be nested so there's car there's this group in this group so this will be our steering and this is our path the reason why i made uh, parenting twice is if you're going to just go with this one and we do the next step it will orient uh, incorrectly so this is like a easy way to do an animation on steering and um, orientation correctly so next is we're going to build our our path so let's go to curves you can do it like the the pencil curve which is freehand but of course it's not smooth or you want to do an EP curve tool so let's just click EP then let's just place a dot here like so as you can see it's it's very smooth let's do like that for an example now let's go to the next step make sure that you are selecting the path only and the curve so that is important now let's go to animation here then go to constraint let's go to motion path and attach motion to path so as you can see the car is uh, oriented incorrectly but it the animation works and the next problem is it's very fast so we can fix that so first of all let's fix the orientation let's go to steering then let's go rotate it here let's go rotate it negative 90 there you go it's now oriented properly if we scrub on the timeline it's now driving to a path like so now let's fix the speed so let's just add here more frames let's just say 500 now let's go to our animation uh, window uh, animation editors and graph editor so let's just grab the path here we click the path and there will be like a line here now let's just grab everything let's go click here on this button region tool now let's just move it way way back so I'm holding up middle mouse to move it to the right let's go to 500 scrub 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 there you go now let's just close this so if we play this it's now driving slowly uh, okay reason why we are just viewing 120 frames so let's go hit 500 as well so if we play it will show 500 frames okay there's that now how to do some fun skids do the driving part so you remember the, the one we made steering right so let's add some keyframes there so let's go to zero let's go here now if you remember the rotate Y let's just key this right click key selected so we driving we driving we driving so let's add like a key here first uh, key selected so let's add that now let's do some oversteer here probably in frame 23 to do that uh, probably here so if we we scrub back it will do an oversteer an illusion that is drifting 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 there you go as you can see uh, drifting then probably some production we are just going to key select here then we're going to ask the car to go straight again so negative 90 so if we go back it will correct there you go drive 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 then probably here let's key select it again and let's do some over correction here in the next frame let's rotate here so it's we're telling the car to go over correct, over steer, let go, drift, 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 drift. Then let's end the drift here again. It's just plain simple like that. 
then we just go back to negative 90 that's that's pretty much how simple this animation goes but yeah that's pretty much it 